I know we are in this season of Thanksgiving, but not everybody is thankful. It doesn't matter if you're rich or poor, free or incarcerated. I've coached all types. The one common denominator of people who are thankful, who are grateful every day, no matter what the season is, they learn how to make good changes from bad experiences. You see, because if you have a bad experience or a problem or a challenge that you have to face, the key to it is what is my mindset regardless of the challenge or the experience? That cannot be changed unless you decide to. I like this quote from James Baldwin. He said, not everything that is faced can be changed, but nothing can be changed until it is faced. My mentor and I were debating about whether or not two people who came from the same difficult environment had to face the same challenges, but one of them succeeded and the other failed. And so then my mentor, who is a, a trained social worker, he's a student of human behavior. He understands the science of psychology presented this narrative to me to make his case. An alcoholic father had twin sons. One son became an alcoholic. The other became a successful businessman. He asked me, Stephen, what was the difference between the two sons? I pondered his question for a moment. And then I thought, okay, well, both sons were twins. So naturally they had some sameness about them. The father passed along some genetic gems, some traits. So they had the propensity and the proclivity to be just like their dad. I mean, her, their dad was uh, an alcoholic and, and, and maybe that was the reason why the one son became an alcoholic. But, but then I realized it, it, it was not a genetic issue because the son who decided to become a successful man did not do what the son did who decided to become an alcoholic. It was not a genetic issue. And then I thought, well, they were reared in the same household and exposed uh, to the same habits of their family life. They had to face the same challenges daily. But then I realized it was not an environmental issue because again, one son decided to become a successful businessman and the other did not. It was not an environmental issue. Oh, oh, here it is. This is what I thought. Okay. Uh, their father could not afford to send them to uh, the finest institutions of higher learning. He sent them to a great public school where there were great instructors there. They learned the same lessons. They received the same information. But then I realized, nope, it was not an educational issue because one son decided to become a successful businessman and the other did not. It doesn't matter what your biology is or your psychology. If you don't decide to do something with what you know, you will not grow. And today I want to challenge you to make good changes from bad experiences, regardless of the season. Give yourself a reason to succeed. And today I'm going to give you one. Your life is a gift today. You were meant to do great things and there's no one in this universe like you. So decide to make a change to grow today.